Welcome back to another episode of Sister Sister. I am your girl India and I'm so happy to be back with you all. I took last week off and if you don't know why, please go check out my previous video on my India Treadwell page for what they got on and I explained everything that went down. Just a little recap, I was exposed to COVID-19 and that gives you all the details. So I will link that, um, that video in the description box below but today honey girl we talking about hair because we are on sister sister and that's what we do on this page we talk about hair and natural hair and actually all types of hair and everything in there but before we get into this video and you guys already know what's it's about it's about the shampoos because you saw the title um make sure you subscribe like comment and hit the notification bell so that way you get notified every time that me and my sister post you know that i post every wednesday and that she posts every saturday so always look out for those two days of you will get great content from us make sure you check out her previous video of the 90s she did recreated recreated a um a 90s makeup look so cute and bomb and i was like girl you gonna do that on me because y'all i don't know how to do my makeup I am awful at doing my own makeup and I really sit there and try and I like it takes hours okay just to get some type of a good look I do not do my brows I know how I do that much baby girl my brows always be on fleek for me but yeah so let's get into all these shampoos and what I really really like to use on my head okay so the first shampoo that I do like to use is the Afro G shampoo don't know if you could see that right there um, this is for damaged hair. I only use this when I'm doing the protein treatment, but guys, this gives a really, really, really good lather and it, um, it leaves my hair stripped and which is what I want to have when I'm using a protein treatment. You don't want to go in with a moisturizing shampoo or anything. You want to go something that's clarifying and this I love and, um, even has restores your pH balance which I really also like. Um, restore shine, help strengthen hair, and normalizes pH. So I really only use this when I'm doing a protein treatment. I did it without using a protein treatment one time and used the shampoo and it worked perfectly fine. I just went in and deep conditioned my hair like I always do anyway and then follow it with a conditioner and this is not. You guys know, you know the process. If you watch my wash day routine. So this is like one of the good shampoos that I like to use as well. The next shampoo I like to use is really not even a shampoo. It's more of like a co-wash and I use this in between wash days if I want to um, do something new with my hair and refresh my hair. And that is the uh, As I Am Long and Luxe Collection Grow Wash. There you go. Um, and this is like just a cleansing cream conditioner. It smells really good actually. It smells like, it smells like pomegranate. That whole line smells like pomegranate and y'all can tell I've been using it because it's almost gone. <laughs> um but this is only in between washes and that is very rare that i use in between washes this lasts you a long time because i rarely co-wash my hair i only co-wash my hair if it's like i mean messed up hairstyle and i'm like girl water won't fix this go ahead and co-wash your hair real quick and redo this style if it's only been like three to four days in between a style and it's just like failing then that's when I go ahead co-wash my hair redo the style and I'm done for the day I don't go in doing a whole wash because most 10 out of, 9 out of 10 times I already went in and did a, either a deep clarifying or a moisture uh, a moisturizing shampoo and speaking of moisturizing shampoos next goes into my favorite um my other favorite shampoo which is the cream of nature moisturizing shampoo and I ran out and so I don't have that bottle anymore. So I'm just going to put a picture probably like around here somewhere of that bottle and or on this side. Either way, y'all know, whichever side I'll put a picture somewhere of that bottle. You can see it is a moisturizing shampoo. And y'all, I love a good moisturizing shampoo, especially if you are experiencing dry hair. and Your hair is always dry. It's, and if you have low porosity or even high porosity because high porosity you're experiencing more dryness but um even it just really depends on your hair guys if you are experiencing a lot of um dryness make sure you use a moisturizing shampoo those really help and they have oils in it 
and um, really cleanse. They really don't cleanse that well. I'm just keep it honest, but it really moisturizes your hair really nice, and it gives great shine. Um, now talking about really cleansing that scalp, honey. If you really want to cleanse your scalp, go ahead and with a fortifying shampoo, and this is the Cream of Nature Aloe and Black Castor Oil Healthy and Long Fortifying Shampoo for weak, breakage-prone, damaged hair. Conditioning aloe, Jamaican black castor oil, and vitamin infused. Now that's the longest title of this bottle. <laughs> but this is what I love to use. You guys saw this in my wash day routine. It's by Cream of Nature. And, whoo, baby girl, it cleans your scalp. And when I say clean, clean, it even leaves, leaves like a little tingly feeling. And uh, you follow this up, it has a hair mask to follow this up with. And that even leaves it. Um, feeling really really your hair really good and strong and healthy and that tingling and it even smells like um the jamaican black, black castor oil um but not like as strong because you know that's a really strong scent but the tingly sensation is definitely from that oil being on your scalp and it cleanses it strips all of everything you got in your head and you don't want to use this weekly this is not a weekly shampoo do not use this weekly because your hair will be like screaming for some moisture this is definitely a shampoo you want to use probably once maybe twice a month because it strips everything away from your hair but it leaves it feeling so good and cleansed and you don't want to strip all your oils away from your hair every single wash day. You only want to do that once or twice a month. And then follow up with the hair mask that's provided or a deep conditioner. Then follow up with your favorite leave-in conditioner or a conditioner. Um, whatever your choice of preference is. Then you can go ahead and style to your liking and use all the other products that you guys like to use. But this, if you need to get rid of product buildup, this is what you want to use. This is it. The last and final shampoo that I also like to use is um, a strengthening shampoo, which is really good if you have weak, damaged hair and um, or hair that's always like breaking off. This is a really good shampoo. And this is by the As I Am Long and Luxe collection as well. Pomegranate and Passion Fruit. It's a strengthening shampoo and height, so it hydrates your hair pretty nice and strengthens your hair strands. Um, Yeah, I'm always dropping something. But yeah, this is really good. And it is for hair types three and four, as well as the um, grow wash is only for hair types three and four. So if you um, don't have those type of hair types, I suggest that you don't use them because if they're saying don't use these, then I suggest you don't use it. But this is really, really thick. It's really a thick shampoo, but I really like it. Um, it strengthens my hair. My hair does feel better. But it doesn't get like, it's not like a fortifying shampoo or clarifying shampoo. It's more just of a strengthening and um, it reduces um, tangles and, well, let's see what it says. It says it cleanses hair and scalp gently, reduces tangles and combing damage, thereby strengthening hair for longer hair lengths. When I do use this comb, I do, I mean comb, when I do use this shampoo, I do realize that um, I'm not experiencing that much tangling and that my hair detangling process is slipping right through when I use this type of shampoo which is what I love um it doesn't lather that great as um as great as the um Afoji for damaged hair which I guess this is more like a strengthening shampoo as well but it doesn't um lather as great as this but it is a really good shampoo if you don't have this one except this one just normalizes your ph balance this one doesn't but it is a really really good healthy shampoo for your hair and i don't think if it has um let me see i want to say this does have sulfates in it yeah it does have a sulfate in it it has several that's why i don't use it that much but if you are experiencing a lot of um, tangling and shedding and all that, use this shampoo. It's going to really help out. Okay, those are my top five shampoos that I love to use. Um, let me know in the comments below what are your top five shampoos and um, which ones you guys want to try out. If you even tried out all of these top five. Um, and yeah.
just let me know what y'all like to use and if you really like these what i have here and if you didn't know the difference of shampoos now you know difference between a moisturizing a strengthening a co-wash and a clarifying and a slash fortifying shampoo now you know the difference of shampoos and when and not to use all that stuff so i hope you hope you guys have a great day make sure you subscribe to this channel and i will see y'all next time bye